Nice ball inside the 18. What a terrific oh. finish. Just a terrific finish by Jessica Fishlock to get it past a <laughs> diving LeBlanc and Fishlock gestures to the crowd. The first two games between the Thorns and Rain were intense and competitive, exactly what you'd expect in a Portland-Seattle matchup. And there's no reason we won't see more of the same on Sunday. It's kind of a derby, if you will. Um, so obviously it's intense, especially given the players that are on either teams. I think we're really looking forward to hopefully getting our first win on Sunday. Yeah, it's, I definitely think that they're our biggest rivals, just because of the games we played against each other, how close they've been, and how we feel we should have got better results. With both teams missing key players, including Hope Solo, Jess Fishlock, Alex Morgan, and Christine Sinclair due to national team commitments, there's an unknown element heading into the match. I think both teams have losses, but I think it's how you prepare. And you can't underestimate Portland without those players. It's still going to be a decent side, and, and I'd probably say vice versa with us. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be an interesting battle, I'm sure. I think it's actually more of an opportunity for all the players who aren't in with the national team. I think it's going to be a great opportunity for them to kind of showcase what, what, what they have, what they bring to the table. It's, it's really giving those players an opportunity to showcase you know, their own skill set and you know, kind of say, hey, look at me. So I think it'll be exciting. The Rain learned earlier this week that two of their remaining games will be on national television on Fox Soccer Channel. The first, a home game July 14th against the Washington Spirit. The second, a rematch against the Spirit back east on August the 10th. For Seattle Rain FC, I'm Tom Glasgow.